Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Sarah with Finding the Clearance Aisle, and I'm back today with a, another haul. It's going to be Dollar Tree. Not a whole lot of items from the Dollar Tree, but some items that I found that I wanted to share with you guys. And then I have a, a one item from Burlington I want to show you, which is my favorite. And then a couple things I want to show you from Walmart. I hope everyone is having a great day. Um, thank you guys so much for all your birthday wishes for Marley. Um, that was so sweet of you guys and all of the congratulation wishes for um, my girls who graduated from school so I really appreciate those that's so thoughtful of you guys my allergies are acting up um, anyway it is kind of late um, but I wanted to show you guys some of the items that I found let's start with Burlington because it's literally one item but let me tell you the item is worth sharing with you guys I found me a Barbie paddle brush. Look how pretty she is. I love it. And look at the price, $2.59. She is worth it. I was so excited when I found that. Um, I took my daughter out for her birthday and um, we went shopping and she got a ton of stuff from Burlington um, that she's already has put away. Um, but anyway, I wanted to show you guys that brush because it's amazing. All right. Then I wanted to show you guys some things I found at Walmart. Um, getting ready for um, the Memorial Day weekend. Um, what are you guys doing? What are your plans? We are going to go to the lake for Memorial Day. So really super excited about that. Um, my uncle has a house at the lake and so that's going to be lots of fun. We love going to the lake um, and just spending some time with him and we usually roast hot dogs down by the lake and we usually do a s'mores with a bonfire before the end of the night so so excited about that what are you guys going to do for memorial's day memorial day oh can't talk glitching already all right so i needed to get some new floats um for the lake and so i found these at walmart these are they are called the transparent mats um it's by blue skate this is five and five feet, six inches long. Um, they had a pink one and they had a blue one. Look at these, they were $1.98 a piece. Seriously, $1.98 a piece. So I got two of them. Um, we needed new floats for this year, last year. I believe most of them got ruined from um, like when it snows, we use the floats, not those, but the round ones, we use them for snow tubing. And so I think that that's probably what happened to most of them, but that's okay. So I got those um, from Walmart. They were $1.98 a piece. Then I went ahead and got these. These are the little tubes. This is says sweet, sweets tube. Oh, that's hard to say. Um, the transparent mat holds up to 220 pounds. This holds up to 175 pounds. It tells you on the bottom, but I got this one here. This was 258, I believe at my Walmart. And then I got a shark one. Um, same thing, 175 pounds. I got the shark one and that one was also 258. Then I decided that I was going to get, um, because I'll be taking the food over to the lake and so I decided just to get some little festive plates. I just got these blue ones. I did get them at Walmart um, because I did not think about it when I was at the Dollar Tree but it did save me. These were only 99 cents or 98 cents. One of those numbers. Um, but there's 20 plates that come in here. So I just got the blue. I'm sorry the color's probably off. It is really late. I just noticed I need to replace these blinds. I'll be doing that soon. Um, and then I found these. I love the red little gingham. Is that not cute? Put those two together. Um, so just look around if you want to have, you know, decorations for a Memorial Day um, where I'm going to be outside. So it's not going to matter. But I just thought these two would be so cute for Memorial Day. So I got those. All right. Now let's move on to the Dollar Tree. Let's see where do I want to start. Okay. Oh, I did get some, okay, let's talk about these. So last year I got some um, floats at Walmart. 
was it last year? The, I mean, the Dollar Tree. Oh my goodness, guys, I'm like mixing my stores. I don't remember if it was last year or the year before, but I got them and they were so super tiny, like so super tiny. I think it was last year. And I was like, what am I supposed to do with these? They were like so super tiny. So um, this year I got smart and I looked at the size of them. So this one, and it feels thick, whereas the other one didn't feel thick at all. This is a slim ring. I don't know if you guys can see there it's a swim ring um and it's for ages four and up let me see if i can open it because i want to show you guys the other one i might not be able to open it and of course i don't have any scissors on camera you know that would make more sense let me see i don't think i can get it open oh i got it open okay all right let's see oh yes okay this is a good size look at this I'm so excited guys last year I know I'm pretty sure it was last year um they were it was so small so I'm gonna tell you what to look for but look how big these are for a dollar 25 a dollar 25 huge this is huge okay so I got three floats I got this rainbow one and I'll show you in just a second okay then I got the kiwi one. Look how cute that is. Looks like someone took a bite out of it. So cute. And then this is just, look at that. It's like neon yellow green. I would say yellow. What would you guys say? I don't know. It's like highlighter. Okay, so let me show you. This is the trick that I learned and I only learned it today. So let me share it with you. All right, so when you look at these, it's gonna be really small and really hard to see. Right down here, it gives you the dimension of it. And you can feel the thickness, like it's, it's thick, it's thick. Okay. The ones that I got from Walmart, um, of course it tells you up here how big it is, but this one is, where's the other number? Oh, 31 inches in diameter. So this one for 258 was 31 inches. This one from the Dollar Tree for $1.25, this one in particular was 26 and a half inches. I know it's so super small, but it says it right here. If you want one that size, a big one, look for that. They're not all like that. Um, I don't want you to end up with one that's super tiny. Guys, when I say super tiny, it's like a toddler. It's like for a toddler. It's so super small. Um, so if you're looking for a really good value for $1.25, look for the 26 and a half inch one. They also had one and I don't remember which one it was. It was 27 inches. Um, I think it was the puzzle piece one. And, but I didn't get that one. I got, I only got three because I was hoping that I was right on the size and I was. So again, look for the one that says 26, 26, ugh, 26 and a half inches. I know you can't see it. It's so super tiny, but for a dollar 25, a float that big, that is an awesome deal. So I picked up three. I may actually go back and get a couple more. Um, because again, that's a really good deal. Um, if you get a lot of snow where you're at and you would love to go snow, like sledding in the snow, if you use one of these rings, you can go snow tubing and it's so much fun. I'm just saying so much fun, but you got to get them now because you're not going to find them in the winter time when you're looking for them. Just saying. Okay. Then I also got, um, some more of these. I got Marley a pair for her birthday. Um, and these are just like going to be like lake shoes, beach shoes, pool shoes, something like that. Right. Um, but these are by Juncture Women. This is the pink one. It has the glitter right here, which I absolutely love. So I got this for one of my daughters and then one of my other daughters needed a pair. And these have the, like the glitter plastic ones. Um, and they come in all different sizes. They even have kids sizes as well. Since I had foot surgery like two years ago, I can't wear flip flops like this. It just hurts um, my toe. But anyway, um, my girls still can wear them. So um, only two of them needed a pair. Um, so $1.25, you can't beat these, especially if you're just wearing them to like the lake or the pool or the beach. You can't beat that. Okay, then, I got 
some more balloons. Have another graduation party coming up. Um, my daughter graduated from high school, and so I needed to get some more balloons. I know my other daughter's daughters. I can't talk today. My other daughter's colors was black, white, and yellow. Hers was the bumblebee theme, um, and so this daughter will be sunflowers. She loves sunflowers. The college that she's going to, their colors are um, black yellow and white and so this is the colors that we're going with so it's 20 latex balloons um so i went ahead and got those this is in the black then the yellow and then in the white so i got a bag of each of those to um decorate for her graduation party um, then I found these these are so stinking cute they also had the pineapple and then they had like a circle one. I guess it was supposed to look like an apple. I'm not really sure. But these have makeup brushes in them. How stinking cute is that? And it even has, do you see that the indentation of like looking like a watermelon? My nose is itching, guys. My allergies are driving me crazy. Um, but you could use this later. You could use this to take this, like put it in your beach bag or your pool bag, your lake bag, whatever it might be. Put some jewelry in there. Or if you have extra change and you want to put change in your purse so it's not going all over the place, you could use this for so many things. And it's just so stinking cute. Um, we picked out the watermelon. Like I said, there was two other ones, um, but this is the one that I got. Speaking of, if you guys um, are on social media don't forget to check me out on instagram and tiktok at finding the clearance aisle i'm getting ready to post some of the cutest things that i found at the dollar tree today um i didn't buy all of them i know i know i know um shocking but i didn't but i did take pictures of them because i want to share them with you guys because they were so stinking cute so anyway all right so then um my daughter wanted some more of the dial soap she loves this one uh, refresh and renew antibacterial it's spring water it smells really really good so i got her that she picked that out she was with me um she also got the arm and hammer ultra max fresh um this is the deodorant it says uh 50 less expensive so i got her this um this is in the one ounce it's like so hard to see but it's down there teeny tiny so we got that um i got another one of these if you're on tiktok you'll see um that some of these have gone viral saying that there is another name brand that is that has something very similar and it's like so much more expensive um check out the dollar tree you can always find all kinds of great dupes at the dollar tree so i picked up another one of these my daughter um uses the one that i got before so i picked up another one um of those then i needed some more um the pencil sharpeners for my eyeliner um it's actually like my condo it's it's a whole bunch of things that i needed it for um so this is a double pack not bad for a dollar 25 i got two and this is in like a i thought it was pink but it's more like a lavender um so i just it has the two can you see it right here it has the two different sizes um so the one i had i've had forever and so i need to get a new one um, then my daughter picked out the Ioni, um, the eye pencil. This is the crayon eyeliner waterproof. And this is in the black. I love Ioni's packaging. It's always just so pretty, so creative. Um, so she picked out that black pencil. Okay. Also too, I'm, we're always buying these always, always my girls love them for their hair. Um, and she got two of them, which was smart because we go through them so fast. This is the, um, pro formula damage repair conditioner, 32 ounces. So they love these. My girls do. And so I got two of them. She actually picked those out. Um, sometimes they're hard to find. So when we see them, we get them. Um, also another repeat buy for us. Sorry, I have hair in my face. Um, this per Cara, and I probably pronounced that wrong, but it's the cocoa butter with vitamin E daily lotion. My girls love this. It smells, oh, it smells so good. If you love cocoa butter, it smells just like cocoa butter. Um, and this is in the 20 ounces. So she picked that out, um, because she loves it. All right, then I got uh, the Dove Original Bar Soap. Same, same daughter wanted this. Um, she loves this. 
And so, got it at the Dollar Tree. All right, very last bag. Oh, I needed a snack, so I opened it. Um, but this is the Lance Toasty um, Cheddar Cheese Crackers. There's six in here. And these are nice just to kind of throw in your purse. I just needed something. I just needed a bite of something. And there's just four crackers in here. Um, so it's nice to throw in your purse or your backpack. Um, beach bag, pool bag, lake bag, just for a little snack. So got that. Oh my gosh, I have been looking for these forever because my girls have been asking for them. I really should have picked up more than one. Now I'm thinking about it, but that's okay. I'll, I'll go back and maybe they'll have it. The Be Pure, these are the blemish patches. These are non-medicated. These work amazing. So when I see them, I buy them. They're just sometimes really, really hard to find. Um, and I've had a really hard time finding them, but I found one today, 24 come in here for $1.25. That's actually a really good deal. Um, my daughter found some soap. Marley got some soap today. Look how cute this is. Now the black is just on the packaging, but when you take it out of the packaging, it still looks like a watermelon. It still has that little watermelon ring. They also had a lemon one and I don't remember the other one. Um, but I think I did get pictures of it, but anyway, so she picked out this one. I don't know what it smells like. I don't know if it actually smells and I don't want to open it because this is hers and she'll open it when she's ready to um also found two more things this is by the spothecary it's gummy bear moisturizing body butter and this is in five ounces guys this is not dollar tree look at that first of all the packaging is so stinking cute um but look at that they only had the gummy bear flavor flavor oh my the gummy bear scent um but it smells so good it's of course sealed but she opened it a little bit so we could smell it it kind of smells like skittles i'm not even gonna lie to you but it smells really really good so got that all right very last thing that we got <clears throat> These are actually by Jelly Belly, and I had to look at it a couple times. It's called Belly Flops Irregular Jelly Beans. What? It's in the 4.7 ounces. Literally, it says irregular jelly beans, and I don't know what that means. Like, um, it says they aren't available very often, but they are Jelly Belly fans love to snap up famous be belly flops. Have you guys heard of these? Um, their special beans taste great, but don't quite meet all of our demanding standards for size, color, shape, and flavor. Look at that. Let me tell you one thing that I absolutely love right here in the bold. I know it's hard to see. It's not going to focus on it. It says made in a peanut free factory. I love it because that means that my daughter can actually try some. So I've never seen these before. Have you guys seen these before? And this was the only package they had left. So apparently it's popular. I don't know. Um, but I thought we'd try it for $1.25. Guys, that's it. That is my haul. I know it was a small haul, but I wanted to show you guys some of the really fun things. And I wanted to let you guys know about those floats because if you need floats for the, for the summer, don't forget to remember my trick. Check out the size. All right, guys, that's all that I got. Again, don't forget, if you're on social media, check me out at Find Me in the Clearance Aisle on Instagram and on TikTok. Um, also, too, if you guys are subscribers, thank you guys so much for all your love, support, your comments. Um, it means so much to me. If you're not a subscriber, I hope that you stay and subscribe. Um, also, too, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. It really does help my channel. All right, guys that is all that I got. I hope you guys have a great, happy, safe for a uh, 4th of July. Oh my gosh. I'm months, months ahead. Memorial day. Oh, wow. I hope you have a happy and safe Memorial day and I'll see you again really, really soon on my next Dollar Tree haul. Bye guys.